Today we're going to look at Doghouse. It's a, another English film. Um, came out, I believe, 2009. But uh, as usual, do this first. Six Blows in the Doghouse. Bastards. But this weekend, this is the plan. They're getting away from it all. First thing we do when we get in the country, we're going to piss up all the trees. We're going to mark our territory. We're going to drink till we've forgotten how to speak. Well, Mikey reckons the women outnumber the men four to one. We're in the middle of nowhere. Please tell me you took a wrong turn. 300 miles from London, the only person we see selling a big issue. Evil dead, those things with the claws in the teeth. Where did all the men go? <laughs> <laughs> Why, calm down. Sound like a dolphin. The two boys have actually created it. It's an army of pissed off, man hating, <laughs> cannibals. <laughs> Me and you, watching Sunday. They both died. Have a nibble. You know you want it. That's my man. We're gonna go down there and bash the living shit out of anything can address. How the hell is? Not very PC, is it? <laughs> so sexy, Tiana. Why don't we forget about all this? This finger food. <laughs> All right, this one I'll make very quickly. I love this film. The trailer actually doesn't do credit. You watch the trailer and go, uh, whatever. It's great. It's funny as hell. It spews entertainment. Just think about that one. It's nonstop. It's gore. There's body parts everywhere. It's just funny. It's great. It's awesome. I love this film. It has basically the guys, the one dude, he, uh, going through a divorce so the guys decide that we need to take them out and you know show them a good time so for the weekend they're gonna go party it up they get to this town and it's completely deserted with the exception of these zombie-fied women who there's some drug or where the again every zombie movie has something virus whatever so they're doing a test women are the only ones affected by it so all the women are now zombified but to make it really fun and interesting is they're all you know, stereotype, you know, people. So you got, um, for example, you got the old granny with her walker zombie. You have the butcher zombie. You have the clipper, you know, hairdresser zombie. So every now and then they'll just show like a store and you're like, oh God, what's this one going to be? You know, the waitress zombie. You have the teenage girl who twirls her hair constantly zombie. It's hilarious. It's great. Again, I highly, highly, highly recommend this. Absolutely loved it. And I didn't even know that, um, again, like my last review had Emily Booth in it. I didn't even know she was in this one, but she's actually the hairdresser zombie. So I found that interesting also. But till next time, guys, um, we are on letter E next. So I will see you guys then. Thank you.